Hey guys, Jake and Frankie here from the Entertainer Squad and we have been invited to the Entertainer's head offices to have a little bit of fun. Now, so cool. let's see what they've got in store. Today we are playing with two Experiment kits from Nickelodeon. How awesome do these look? Honestly, I'm so excited. Me too. So I've got the experiments in the kitchen box. Awesome. And I've got the wonders of water. Oh, Let's check it yeah. out. Yeah. <laughs> Look at these wires. You even get pipettes in awesome. it. This actually makes me feel like an actual scientist when I play with this. There's still time for yeah. a scientist. Do you think? Yeah, when you grow up. I think we should use yours first. Yeah, I reckon so. Yeah. First things first, you're going to need to cut out this little fish just here. Safety first, always get an adult to help you out. You'll need a small measuring cup yep. and a bowl. Would you be kind enough to fetch us some water? Yeah. Awesome. Back in a sec. Right, I have the water. Excellent. To make this experiment a little bit more exciting, we're going to need blue dye. Perfect. There you go. Thank you. And a pipette for you. Now, you don't need to have the blue dye in this, but it just makes it that much more fun. Yeah, <laughs> look at so that. Using the pipette, I'm just going to give it a bit of a swirl. Oh, yeah, that's cool. Oh. So, let's place all of our water in this bowl. Okay. Oh, perfect. Oh, that's so pretty. Yeah. I'm going to put the little fish in the measuring cup. Yeah. There we go. Observe the results. That is fully in the water. Dry as a bone. <laughs> oh, that is on, awesome. That is absolutely. How does it work? Well, You're putting that into water. I don't... This is happening because even though the cup seems like it's empty, it's not actually empty. So when we place the cup in the bowl of water, there's still air inside, and that's how it doesn't get wet. Oh. Yeah? And there's loads more experiments that we can do in here. We've got balloons, we can use the bubbles. There's so much that we're going to have a look at later. I think it's time for me to show you something. The yeah, real scientist the is now at work. Right, watch and learn. For this one, you will need a spatula. Awesome. A balloon. Got it. Sea salt. Yeah. Black pepper. Uh -huh. And a plate. What we've got to do first is we've got to pour equal measures of salt and pepper uh -huh. onto the plate awesome. and mix well with the wooden spatula. So, put these to one side. Uh -huh. Go. Give it a little mix. Lovely. You've got to blow up a balloon and tie it at the end. I'll leave you to do this. I'll blow the other one up. All right, who's getting it All right, so you ready? Ready? Three, two, one. I can't tie a balloon. That first means... Tie, right, hold on. There's a first tie for everything. That I won. <laughs> Not fair. We'll use yours. Thanks. So what we need to do now is we need to rub it on someone's hair for 30 seconds. Oh, who's? Are we nearly there? Yeah. Anytime. Yeah. You have to hold the balloon near the mixture, around about 20 centimetres away, and slowly move the balloon Closer okay. to the plate. About like here. Can you see that? That's amazing. That's so cool. And if you turn it. How does it work? So the pepper grains are attracted to the balloon through static electricity. When the balloon's on its own, it has a neutral electric charge. Right. But when it's rubbed on your hair, it becomes a negatively charged balloon. Oh. So both the salt and the pepper have a positive charge. They both react and the charges come together and stick to the balloon. Also, the pepper is lighter than the salt as well, so the pepper goes first and then the salt comes second and it all just goes crazy. So these experiments are actually created by real scientists, kind of like myself, and how fun are they? They're so exactly. easy to do. That's the best part. They're yeah. so much fun and you're learning at yeah. the same time. Now, there is so many more experiments that you can get involved in with these kits as well. We're gonna play with the power of the lemons. Now, if you want to play with any of the experiment stuff, head down to your local entertainer store or visit thetoyshop.com.